All right, guys, I got something new I'm unboxing. I know what it is, but I've never seen it yet. This is a, a company named New View Hunting. Reached out to me on Instagram, I believe, and they asked me if there was any gear that they had that I'd be interested in checking out. And I told them that I was looking for a backpack. So I believe this will be the backpack. We're using the old Spyderco Para 2 to open everything. All right, so let's see what we got here. I'm gonna set this down and then pull it out. All right, got a couple things there. All right, it says, hi hunters, nice to meet you all. It's hunting that brings us together. Hunting trips are always full of happiness, hardships, expectations, and disappointments. We don't know what tomorrow will be, but it will be, an, it will all be unforgettable memories. The only thing you can be sure of is that New View Hunting is always with you from the beginning to the end. We are committed to providing equipment trusted by hunters. Keep listening to hunters. Best wishes to the best hunters. Enjoy your hunting journey. Enjoy your life. Yes, hunting is life. Best wishes, new view hunting. Got a 180 days free extended warranty. So, first thing right off the bat. This is a all-weather cover over the pack. As elastic there's a strap this is to uh, cover the pack from weather it says BP vision now my first thought when I saw that blue I was like well that kind of clashes with a hunting setup um, I guess for visibility purposes this would be good to have over your pack but if I'm trying to hide from someone, I wouldn't want the blue one here. And if I'm using it for hunting purposes, honestly, I'd rather it be like uh, blaze orange. But I don't know. Again, this was just sent to me. I didn't pay anything for this. I told them, you know, I would give an honest review. They may have blaze orange available or they may have camouflage available. I don't know. Like I said, I didn't. I just told them a pack, told them I wanted the big one and uh, they sent it to me. So there may be other colors available. That was just the first thing that jumped out at me. These are parts for the inside of the pack, I believe. All right. Where, where is the top of this? Now this pack is quite large. Okay, so this is the top of the pack. Camo's not bad. I've got some, I think I've got some pants in this camo collar. Lots of pockets. I like that it's mostly zippers and buckles and not Velcro. Velcro makes a whole lot of noise. Okay, so let's see what we got here. Wow. Actually, unsnapping them isn't very loud, which is good. Going back in, it's loud. But I'm going to be quiet for a minute so you can hear this. So you can hear it, but it's not super loud. And that's good if you're un unhooking things while you're hunting. Well, that's kind of... Uh... Let me see if that's just an accident.
Okay, it's all right. It just that zipper had come loose. Pretty big pocket. Inside is black with uh, camo. Stitching doesn't look terrible. It's actually a pretty big pocket. Now this is just an initial reaction. Obviously I'm not going to have any solid wear and tear for you guys till later on. Now, okay, so this is something here. There's no end or begin. Maybe that's designed that way, but if you look, I mean, it's already, it's already pulling open. That's never good. Well, okay, that's not as big a deal because there's, there's twin zippers. So maybe just, I don't know. Now that is a really, really big pocket. You've got some reflective material on the outside. You could hook some gear in there. Of course, I mean, Chinese stuff. Everything's made in China. So I'm assuming, I, I don't know anything about this hunting company, or this, this company yet, this gear company. Actually, I'm going to put my zippers in the middle and see if it still keeps popping that zipper loose. So it looks like, just from what I can tell, it looks like maybe they're just uh, you know buying bulk from China and reselling it. Which I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. I'm I'm not going to knock on anybody for that. But I'm just trying to be real with everybody. We got another pocket. All right, so that's exactly the same as the other. I'm not, I'm not going to go into opening that one. I want to see different things. All right, so what is this for? Oh, I guess this is for buckling the top maybe. Yeah, that's for buckling the top. One of, now one of the things I've noticed, I mean, there the, the logos on this, there, there's no logos from New View Hunting. Um, I mean, I would have thought, I mean, it says BP Vision on it. BP Vision, which I'm assuming is just the brand put on by the Chinese company that makes these. Which again, I'm, I'm not knocking it, I just, I find that a little bit odd. Uh, you've got your straps on the bottom. So like if you want to put a backpack, you've got a couple hooks down here, or, you know, looped, where you can loop string and stuff into to tie something to. Let's see what this big pocket looks like. Oh, okay. Um, so it is a, let me move this back a little bit. This is so you can get to your gear from inside here. And then you can even, so this is actually kind of cool. I like this. So in here, you can zip this right here. To where you can you've got two different compartments see if you can see this um, so you can have stuff up top and you can have something in the bottom and you can get into the bottom without having to drag everything out of the top I, I do really really like that double zippers so most of this stuff's got double zippers let's look at the other let's look at the front um, so here's your your waist you got the waist thing your waist belt, it's got a couple pockets. It's a couple small pockets. Same thing on the other side. Lots of buckles. Now me personally, if you guys have watched any of my videos, you know I have, also that's a whistle, isn't it? Huh. Yeah, there is a, there's a, an emergency whistle in here. It works pretty well too. Um, what I was saying is, you guys know. I mean, you can see my shirt. I'm a fan of the orange, bright orange, and there's bright orange sewing in there. Um, the pads feel relatively good. It's 
it seems like there's a little too much going on with the straps. Maybe once I get it fitted out, it's not as big a deal. Uh, but that feels like it would cushion you pretty well. Now these... These metal things are supposed to go in the pack somewhere to help stabilize it. But there was no directions with it. So I'm not exactly sure where they go. You've got... Sorry, I'm making a whole bunch of noise. Let me loosen this up. So you've got like a gear bladder down in here, or not a gear bladder, but a, like a water bladder. There's a couple straps. Now there is some Velcro right there for holding gear in there. And it's a pretty decent sized bag. I'm just not sure where those go. I may have to look on their website and see. These are so supposed to be, I think they run up and down the back like that to give you some rigid, some rigidity, rigidity, high rigidity, some rigidity. But I just don't know where they go. All right, I mean, that's pretty much it. Is there a pocket here? There's a pocket up here. We'll try to find out where these things go. Other than a couple of the zippers that looked like they were, you know, the zippers were already loose and you had to zip it around and bring it back, but everything zipped back up just fine. Um, initial reaction, I mean, it looks like a good enough pack. We'll see how it'll hold up. I'll maybe try to do some hiking in it and see if it's going to be worth recommending. I mean, obviously right now I can't recommend it only because I, I've just looked at it. I don't, I don't really know how good it is or is not. And I need to find out where these things go. Um, so if y'all want to see more gear reviews like this, you guys, uh, hit that like button. If you're watching on Facebook, you know, hit that follow button. If you're watching on YouTube, hit subscribe. Um, I do appreciate all my subscribers. I do appreciate everybody that's following the page. And um, drop me a, m a message down in the comments. Tell me if you like seeing this kind of stuff or if I'm stupid and you don't want to see it. Um, just let me know. Thanks, folks.